Hi everyone, it's Amanda from gingermum.com. How are you all doing? Today's vlog is going to be a River Island and H&M haul. So I recently um, went on a little spring spree and got some lots of nice bits and pieces, some of which I've been wearing to death already. So I thought it was only right that I share it with you. So just bear with me a minute. Okay, this is what I have bought. So first of all, we've got the black top. It's only um, £28 for the start. It's got a lovely ruched neckline, which I really, really like. And then quite a sexy little ruched sleeve as well. I styled this up with white jeans because white jean season is almost upon us. Woo, 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 woo. Except I don't really know why I'm saying that because having loads of bloody cellulite like I do, um, I do struggle to find a good pair of white jeans because it kind of shows, or I'm, I'm paranoid about it and I think it shows through the white, it's like lumpy, 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 lumpy. However, some people do rock a beautiful white jean and it is probably the most versatile piece for summer. Anyway, back to the top. So yeah, I put this on with my beautiful black Versace blazer that I've had for such a long time. It's basically um, a really easy piece to wear. It's really light. You just put like a little cami under it and you're good to go. So this was the first item and I have, haven't worn this yet out but I'm planning to wear it to an event um, on Tuesday. obsessed with tops. I have so many jeans and trousers and stuff in my wardrobe that I really thought I need to just update my tops. It's a really cheap way of sorting out a spring wardrobe. If you've got lots of skirts, jeans and trousers you don't really need to spend a fortune on um, a new spring wardrobe. So a few nice tops and it's instantly updated. So I've got this lovely red top and um, I just thought it was really nice. I'll show you it really closely up. Um, this one, I got all these in a size 12 because I am a kind of 10 on top but often I'll need a 12 just for a bit of space. I mean this one, this is a beautiful River Island top and it's not the most flattering angle here because I'm not really a very good um, vlogger in terms of looking perfect, it's just not going to happen. Um, but yeah, this beautiful top which I love, like a butterfly, um, this top is um, one of my favourites. And this, I bought this in a 10 and it was like right up here and it was like right across the boobs which is no good. So I've gone for a 12 and even though there is lots of space and it's so floaty that it doesn't actually matter and I really like doing this with my arms because it gives me a really good silhouette. Anyway, so um, yeah, I went for the 12 in this. I also, did I go for the 12 in that? I think I might have, yes, 12. River Island, I do come up as a size 12 so um, I've been buying it for years and they're not paying me to talk about this. I just love River Island. I would say it's probably my favourite high street shop in terms of always being able to go in, choose something for the occasion and come out with a win-win. Uh, I do love my Chanel, I do love all my high-end fashion, um, but I do think it's great to mix up your high street and your designer and that's basically the thread that runs through my life. So yeah, River Island, love ya. Okay, so this red top, again in the size 12, um, is really, really pretty. It has the obligatory ruffle that's going on at the moment, but it also has a really nice bit of crochet detailing, which I will lean over and show you here. And yeah, it goes really well. It's, I mean, you don't need me to tell you how to style this one up. It's basically a black skinny jean job, isn't it? Um, and yeah, it's really good if you have like a pair of red colour heels, just stick them on with it and um, you're good to go. Okay, this one, 
is an amazing piece. It's basically, I had so many compliments. I wore this on Saturday and I absolutely loved it. So you can see the floral theme going on there. So it was just um, one of River Island's new pieces and it's basically just um, a roti casual jacket. I think it was 64 99 or 54 99 I will check and I will link it below. Um, but yeah, basically there's so many lovely colours in this. You can pair it with most things. You could put it with blue jeans. Um, I actually did. I put it with my TK Maxx blue um, ripped jeans that don't have real rips because the cellulite pops through. Um, they've got like pearls and sparkles and I'll put a few pictures of them rolling on now so that you can see what they look like. So yeah, I put it with my ripped jeans, uh, a pair of Prada pumps, and what else did I, oh, um, I think it was just like a plain bodysuit in the same shade um, as some of the flowers, so it just made the top pop out rather than what I was wearing underneath, so the focus was actually on this. So yeah, I did a lot of twirling pictures. Um, shall I put it on now and then you can see it? Okay, it's not going to go with the pink, but you know, can't shoot me. Um, we're just multitasking. So yeah, basically this is the pattern of it. Yeah, you can see that the sleeves go to about here. Old button detailing here, um, which is really nice. And it is just so floaty. So we did a lot of um, twirling, woohoo. So yeah, this is gorgeous, I love it. And then um, actually it was in my bag all day on the Thursday when I bought it. Took it home, not a crease in it, which is always a good thing because who really wants to iron their clothes before they wear them? Not me. So, um, oh, I've just realised I've got this massive big um, bouquet of flowers here and I haven't really explained it. So basically, these were sent to me by Apple Yard London. I think you can see them in there, Apple Yard. Oh, they are so beautiful. They smell divine. I wish this was a scratch and sniff vlog, but basically these are the flowers. I have never been given so many flowers at once. They are just stunning. Um, and so they are going to just pop open over the next few days. So I'm sure there'll be lots of my blog posts. And I know they've got paper around them, but I kind of sometimes like that more than putting them in a vase. Um, yeah, so let's finish this off. So basically the, um, the other two items that I wanted to show you today are this. This is not River Island anymore. We've moved on to H&M. And I have to say, I have to be honest, H&M is sometimes such a hit or a miss for me. I can go in there walk around and just be bereft of inspiration. However, they have had two really fab pieces of trans-seasonal knitwear that I have snapped up. Um, my hair is such a mess today, sorry people. Today I did the school run, um, it was really windy. Um, my makeup looks like a bit like pants today and my hair is a little bit, um, blah, 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 but I don't care, it's fine. It was either that or not filming the vlog, so I'm doing the vlog. Anyway, back to the subject in hand. So. This really nice little easy to wear piece from H&M. A bit of a blogger look if I'm honest. Um, the whole like soft pastel um, or nude jumper with the crisp white shirt popping out. So I think H&M have just been like bang that trend. We're going to bring one out and sell loads of them. So um, at £24.99 you just cannot go wrong. Now I love a white shirt. This is all very Lydia Elise Millen look as well, which I mean she she just has such a fantastic look. So this is um this is just an easy wear version of it. And I love a crisp white shirt, but sometimes it's just not practical to have it standing in the, the wardrobe all neatly ready to put on. So this is really easy in this trans seasonal um, period we're in because it's bloody freezing outside but the sun was shining this morning so you want to kind of look as though you're rocking that spring vibe but also not freeze your nips off really so um yeah basically this is my favorite um kind of blogger off duty oh god there's a delivery man and i'm doing my vlog hang on i'll be back in a second Hi, I'm back. Okay, so that was the Paso Force Man. So yeah, as I was saying, this H&M 24.99, Bish Bosch, job done. Um, you can rock it for the school run, you can rock it for blogger events, you can rock it for a little bit of shopping with your friends, whatever, basically, you know what you want to wear it for. I wore it with 
my favourite, favourite over the knee boots from River Island which are still available so I will link that um, vlog in the description box below or was that a vlog? I can't remember anyway you can look at those boots in much more detail in the link below I wore it with my kind of like wet look leggings because I don't have leather trousers much to my absolute upset so I just shoved some you know like three years ago wet look leggings were really in so um, I keep everything so I still had them so shoved them on with the boots and this and then um, I think it was my Chanel bag that I styled it up with so um, yeah job done Finally, finally, finally in love with this jumper completely. This is the top. Um, it's ever so cute. It is a lovely cold shoulder. The colour is great. I wore it with a really old Zara skirt, Zara leather skirt, which is a bit too short for me, but it's got a waistband, so if I just like hike it down a little bit, it just sits at a nice angle. And I thought I wouldn't really get much wear out of that skirt, but it just shows you how if you buy like one new piece, you can, you know, you can reuse something in your wardrobe that you perhaps haven't been using to its full potential. So I put that on with black tights and I got my little Gucci limited edition um, tote out. <laughs> style about it's like the Louis Vuitton Speedy, but it's um, Gucci. Anyway, it's vintage. It has never, it's been used once actually, it has, it's been used once and it cost me a fortune back then but it'd be worth so much more now and I'm thinking about selling it because my life is just not tailored to that kind of beautiful bag because I have quite a busy life, I've got two kids, I'm always running about and I'm scared to get it dirty or messed up so I might be selling that on Depop or Vestia Collective or whatever um, so I will let you know if I do decide to sell it. Anyway, this goes perfectly with it. Um, I just love it, I really do, it's one of my favourite pieces that I've bought and again I think it was around like 29.99 mark um, but it feels like silk wool so it feels beautiful on, you instantly feel really really dressed up um, and that's what we want to feel like when we buy something otherwise what's the point in spending our hard earned cash? <laughs> Okay, so like I said earlier on, I realised that I'm talking really fast and I don't know why. Actually I do. I have to go to Aldi's, do the food shop, get the school run done, I have to put my youngest son's football stuff down to the childminder and I also said I'd take my friend out for a spin in my new car. So yeah, that's why I'm talking a bit fast because I've got a lot of stuff to pack into this little vlog. The vlog today. So I hope you've enjoyed my River Island and H&M haul. Hope it gave you a bit of inspiration. Um, I will try and link down below everything that we've talked about um, so that you can have a, a look for yourself and order whatever you want to order. But I will just send you links that are not affiliate links or anything. I don't get anything from it, but I will put them below because we all need to shop and I think you might like these pieces. So um, yeah, I'll do that and um, just let me know what you think of the video. Please give me a thumbs up if you liked it because it's always nice to know what people think and also it makes it a bit more worthwhile. So thank you so much and I will see you next time on my regular vlogs, okay?